peace. Assalamu alaikum. This is Lorena. So, what's going on? <laughs> I'm going to be busy for the next few days. So I said, let me just go live. Because I'm going to be running like crazy for the next few days. I have fundraisers um, for a few days. And an event on Sunday. I might go live again before my event on Sunday to remind you guys. Come see me at the Easter Market at my pop-up. But anyway, I just had to kind of share with you about business and why Sensi is the perfect opportunity for anyone because there's no age restriction there's no uh, competition from the company anytime somebody wants to order something they go to Sensi.com. Sensi will refer them to a person in their zip code or ask them to pick their consultant. If they know their consultant's name, they can just put their consultant's name in the search bar and their consultant will come up. So they're not taking any sales from us. Uh, you don't need to carry inventory. If you don't want to carry inventory, you don't have to. You have your website. The website is only $15 a month, which is a tax write-off. It's $150. Like fifty dollars, fifty, uh, like eighty dollars a year, or so. Okay, <laughs> that's that's like what a drop in the bucket to promote your business because they have millions of dollars worth of product in the warehouse. All you have to do is just share it and let people know what's available. They update everything for you. You don't have to do any updates, sales. Uh, new products to come out. You don't have to try to rush and try to find a picture for it and put it up. There. It's already there for you. Okay, I used to do eBay. And you have to pay, take the pictures yourself. You have to post the pictures yourself. You have to make the sale if it's a sale. And you have to ship the product. Please. If somebody goes to your website and, and purchase something, you don't have to worry about trying to ship it. Same thing with Amazon. I used to do Amazon too. You got to find that package, find that product put it in there and ship it out quick too because if you don't ship it out quick then you get bad reviews all right so all that part is like no brainer you don't have to worry about that um and you can go at your own pace so if you just want to work on the weekends you can work on the weekends if you just want to work in the morning you can work in the morning if you want to work in the evening you can work in the evening you work at your own pace what works for you you want to do online, you can do online. You want to do in-person, you can do in-person. It is just so flexible. And really, it's inexpensive to get started. You can start for zero dollars, okay? No out-of-pocket expense. You don't have to even pay for the $99 kit. You can earn your kit. Now, when you earn your kit, you get the host exclusive kit. And with the host exclusive kit, you get a warmer, you get a wax bar, you get some samples of some other products, you get some catalogs, testers for people to smell. So you actually have something to work with, okay? So um, at that point, you can purchase some stuff half off because uh, it's your party. Purchase some things half off that didn't come, that's not coming with your kit. Maybe you want to order some, some, some cleaning products or a fragrance flower. You know, maybe that's not in your kit, something that you can have to show. So... But you're getting it half off. All right? So the half off and free, it's a great deal. So if, you just, if you're doing it to get a discount for yourself, that's okay too. That's what Costco is. That's what Sam's Club is. They have an opportunity for you to get a discount on everything you buy. But as a business person, if you want a business account with Costco or Sam's Club, whatever, you can go in there and buy a whole flatbed full of stuff and take it back somewhere and sell it and make some money off of it, okay? So that's the same thing with Sensi. You can be a wholesale buyer and just buy and save money for your own products because you want your house to smell good. You want some pretty warmers for your house. Or you can make it into a business and sell to other people and make some money off of what you're selling to them. Or you can take it the next step further and grow a, a, a team or an organization of other people, like-minded people that want to earn some money and have some extra income and grow a team. So that's the way it works. I mean, it's not, it is, it's really not a, a pyramid scheme. It is really not. It's really not, okay? I am an independent 
Sensi Consultant. I, I have Sensi on my shirt, but I have a shirt that says Sensi Independent Consultant. Everybody is an independent consultant. You are working for yourself. Sensi is your supplier. Once you buy the products from them, that's up to you to sell to sell it. Okay, if you want to go that route, they will not allow you to buy a million dollar product and open up a Sensi store. All right. If you're thinking you're going to do that, no, that's not, that you can't do that, all right? You can't open up a Sensi store that will give you a better, more advantage than the regular person who just can't afford to do that. So everybody can uh, just do temporary events. You go there, set up, set your stuff, then you break your stuff down, and you take it back where, where, and store it to your next event, okay? That's how that works. If you want to sell retail in a big volume, it has to be a temporary event. So getting back to the subject. It's really not a big gamble. Most businesses that you go in, you have to go take a loan out. You have to get to, go to the bank and say, okay, uh, my rent is going to be this. I need this much for inventory. I need this much to pay my employees. And so unless you done worked and saved up a whole lot of money or you get a loan, you, you really, you need some startup money. You need a credit card in order to finance all that stuff, okay? <laughs> That's just it. My husband was in business for over 40 years. I helped him with his construction business. And I'm telling you, being in business, you have to, you have to be a, a, a strong person. Okay, you can't be weak. You can't be weak. If you're if you out there on your own and you're dealing with the public, it's, it's a trip. Okay? He had one customer. She got a loan from the bank. And after all the work was finished, she had to sign off. The inspectors came, everything passed. But she was upset because it took a little longer than what she thought it should take. And she would not sign off on the job for him to get the rest of the money. It was $4,000. He took her to court. He won the first time, and she appealed and went back and cried a sob story, and they sided with her. And so he never did get his money. $4,000 gone. Just like that. In business, you're going to lose money sometime. So with Sissy, <laughs> so you don't have to, you have to worry about that as much. You know what I'm saying? You don't have to worry about it as much. Another example. He did some work for a nonprofit on the east side. And, you know, he had to buy a material and pay his employees and everything. So when it came time to get paid, it was through the state. The state gave the person the check. They did not pay my husband. He refused to pay my husband. They, my husband complained to the state. The state called them to the office. In fact, they didn't pay my husband or the person who did the, the heating for the building. Refused to pay them too. Thousands of dollars. $10,000 he lost on that job. You know, and it was other jobs too. So finally, he just started doing work for the city of Detroit because he got tired of being stiffed for his money. But, in doing that, he had to front all of the material. He had to buy everything for the jobs because they don't give you any money up front. So if it's a $25,000 job or a $50,000 job, you have to find the material and the labor and all of that. And you have to wait maybe sometimes two or three months after you even turn the job in to get your money. You sell some stuff with Sissy, next month you're getting paid, okay? <laughs> You have a good month. Next month, you're going to get your commission check, all right? You don't have to wait three months, all right? That's a, that's a good part about it, all right? So I'm just saying, if you're trying to be out there on your own and be in business, it is not, it's not a cakewalk. It is really not. You have to come up with a whole lot of money up front, and you have to try to um, advertise your product. You have to sometimes make the product yourself. Okay, all right, all right, you, you know how to make candles. You know how to make lotions. I mean, but really, how, how much lotions and, and candles do you really want to make by yourself? You got to go find it. I got a girlfriend. She's a, a, a candle maker. During COVID, she couldn't even get supplies to make her stuff. It was a shortage, shortage on, you know, I guess, uh, 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 supply chain business. She couldn't even get containers to put her, her, uh, her candle wax in. I don't want to have to worry about that. 
And since he has so many prob uh, products, that if one thing is out, the other product is in, okay? Maybe that, maybe the fragrance flowers are out. They don't have any, okay? But they have some wax bars. They always have wax bars. You don't have to worry about that. They might not have the fragrance you want, but you can just find another fragrance that you can buy until the other one come back in stock, okay? Because they have like 80 different scents at any time. So it's, wax is always available. They might run out of uh, a particular fragrance of the fragrance flowers. Sometimes they might run out of the fragrance flowers altogether. One while when they first came out with the fragrance flowers, they just, they sold out. They couldn't keep them in stock. They had to have uh, uh, the the little village that was making that to have them hire more people to help them make the flowers because they, they couldn't keep up. So... Candle business is a billion dollar industry. It is a billion dollar in fragrance, fragrance and candles and and and, uh, and oils and stuff. We sell diffusers and oils too. So maybe they're not a a, a a candle person, but they they like oils. So we have that as well for the people who like diffusers. Okay, they've been doing diffusers for like about five years now. All right. So and then they have the cleaning products. All right. They have the body parts. They have the hand lotions and the shower gels and stuff. So they have things that people actually use. Things that people are going to use up and they're going to need some more. Now, it's sad, but Tupperware is in, in at Target. If you go to Target.com, you can find Tupperware. Now, I, I know this girl, me and her used to vend her together. She sold Tupperware. She, at that time, she had been selling Tupperware for like 15 years. I can't imagine. You've been selling Tupperware for 15, 20 years, and then all of a sudden it's at Target. Really? They just threw their they consultants up under the bus. That is just not right. So, anywho, I'm going on and on. But I'm just saying, if you think that Sensi would work for you, if it's something that you might be interested in doing, you want to talk to me more about it, message me so we can talk about it. Message me if you're ready to get started because I can help you do that for no out-of-pocket expense. You can earn your kit. If you want to just go in and pay for your kit outright and get going, that's fine too. It's $99. What business can you start for, for $99 plus tax and shipping? What? You know, that have buku products that you can sell. Candles, warmers, wax, cleaning products, laundry products. They have just about everything you need for your home. And things that are consumable that is going to be used up and people have to buy more. Okay? I'm not, I'm not knocking no other company. I'm not knocking no other company. I'm just saying, when you're in sales, you need to be selling something that is consumable, that's going to run out and people are going to need some more at some point. If you're selling things that is not consumable, I mean, really. And just like Tupperware, how many how many bowls do you really need? How many containers do you really need? I mean, how many pots and pans do you really need? I the pamper chef people be trying to tell me, to, okay, I'm having tap pamper chef thing. You know, I don't need another pot or a pan. I've been cooking for seventy years. I don't need another pot or a pan or a knife or nothing. Really, I don't. I don't need another bowl. I don't need another Tupperware bowl. I really, I don't. Okay, I don't. <laughs> I will buy some earrings for my paparazzi people once in a while. But I don't need another pair of earrings either. I've been buying earrings for 50 years. Okay? Probably longer than that. Probably 60 years. Okay? Because I was probably buying when I was a teenager. So, no. You need to be selling products that's consumable that's going to run out and people going to need some more. I'm just saying. That's just it. So, if you're ready to get started, I'm ready to help you. And uh, message me. I'm going to put my... disclaimer in the comments <laughs> on this post because when you start talking about income folks be getting excited and stuff so i'm gonna just put the information about uh, income because it depends on how much you work if you don't work you're not gonna get paid i'm just gonna say that if you get your kit and you never tell anybody i'm a sensei consultant and this is my website it's like if a tree fell in the forest and nobody heard it or saw it did it fall <laughs> If you don't tell nobody about it, they're not going to know nothing about your website, all right? If you don't share it, nobody's going to know anything about it, and you won't make any money. You never let anybody smell anything. You never you never let them try the lotion. You, 
No, you're not going to make any money. You have to let people experience the product, and then you will sell the product. It's simple as that. Simple as that. All right, you guys have a peaceful day. Peace. Assalamu alaikum.